Using memory on Rabbit R1 to trigger LAN Playground and get specific information. So one cool way to use the memory feature is you can put in any given phrase that you want and tell it to navigate to a certain website using LAN Playground and then summarize what's on that website. So in this example, what I've done is uh, I've told it that when I say the phrase, what's new with Rabbit R1, it should use the LAN Playground to navigate to our release notes topic on our forum and summarize the most recent update. So let's give that a try. What's new with Rabbit R1? Viewing instructions about enabling the memory feature on the Rabbit R1 device. Navigating to the release notes section of the Rabbit Community Forum to find recent R1 updates. Navigating to the Rabbit OS release notes posted by Simon 16 minutes ago. Latest update for Rabbit R1. The most recent update for Rabbit R1, dated May 16th, 2025, introduces a new memory feature. Here are the highlights. 1. Memory Log System Allows users to add memories to give R1 context for future interactions. Can be enabled through the R1 settings. 2. Features of Memory Save personal preferences like dietary restrictions. Modify R1's personality according to user preferences. Create complex routines by combining different R1 functions. Trigger teach mode lessons and LAM playground sessions. 3. Bunny memory operator. An interview process with a bunny memory operator helps users get started with the memory feature. Feel free to ask if you need more details or have any questions. So there we have it. I can always just say what's new with Rabbit R1 and it'll navigate to the release notes and it'll tell me the latest update. Enjoy.